Maschinenpistole. Maschinen, Maschinenpistole. Maybe, how do I say it? Maschinenpistole. Hi guys, this is Matthias, and in this video I'd like to showcase three different weapons that are coming with the upcoming DLC, Turning the Tides. Now the weapons I will show you is one for Assault, one for Support, and one for Medic. I'm not going to cover the new weapon of the Scout class. Now the new weapon for the Assault class is this pistol. It's a 16 bullet automatic pistol called Machine Pistole or Machine Pistole M1912 P16. And at this point in time, when I'm trying this out, there is only the Storm version. Now, the fact that this is a Storm weapon was something I didn't really pay attention to when I picked it or when I played with it. So you'll see me mostly hipfire with it, actually, even though I shouldn't. But it actually works really well anyway. Now, reloading with this weapon is something that you want to pay, pay a little bit extra attention to. Basically, it loads in two clips of eight, and unless you emptied either one or both of the magazines, then it will reload individual bullets, making it take a lot of time to uh, fill up the magazine. Much like several medic weapons. And here in the beginning, I wasn't really paying attention to this. <laughs> so much reloading. Very different way of playing this game with this weapon. Yeah, as you can see here on CTE at this point in time, there are no textures on uh, these new maps, but yeah, obviously it's not going to look like this once the DLC is out. Now check out the way it looks when I reload this gun when it's completely empty. See? A lot faster. Now we will come back to this machine pistol later, but first let me show you the new LMG of the support class. This weapon is called M1917 MG Lower Weight. Now there is a telescopic version as well, and I'm sure you understand uh, the differences between those weapons. Now check out the magazine size of this weapon. 250 bullets. And the funny thing is, of course, if you get a kill or two, you're going to automatically reload, or at least I do that. Call it a bad habit, or a reflex. Oh, ah, uh, what? Can I? What? I have to re Why am I reloading? <laughs> I have to reload, guys. I only have 190 bullets in the magazine. I have to reload. Of course I have to reload. You know that. Oh, he didn't die? He was in the bush! Oh, he wrecked me! Oh, he has two! Oh, that's the one! Farkau here! Farkahau? Farkuhar? Farkuhar! Hill, optical. He wrecked me. I hit him, he has two HP after I hit him like that. No, 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 don't kill me, 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 and yeah, at least I think it's called Farkuhar. Now personally, I'm not entirely sure whether or not I will prefer the Storm or the Optical version of this particular weapon. To me, this is actually a bit of a hard choice. At least here, testing it on CTE. Now, aside from the new maps and the new weapons, there are quite a number of other changes that has been made. And I think the most noticeable, at least for me, is the so-called ADAD spam, meaning your ability to strafe quickly left and right. Now, this nerf to strafing is a quite strong nerf to especially, I think, the assault class, but also, in all honesty, to trench weapons in general. Now, obviously, you can strafe left and right with any weapon, any class, but the way I see it, it is with trench weapons, and especially with the assault class, that this is the strongest. 
I have to say it is a little bit unfortunate that uh, most of the times when I go on CTE, uh, the servers, which are not that many, are for the most part rather empty. Or maybe it's just that I picked the wrong ones. For the most part, while recording this, there was about six or seven people in each team. And that doesn't really fill up the map to give you that battlefield feeling. Now I'm out of ammo again. He tells me where these guys are. Oh shit! Parabellum! Well, yeah. So yeah, for the rest of the video you'll see me playing on this map using either the assault weapon, the medic weapon, or the uh, support weapon that I just talked about. And I really hope that uh, this video helped you get a feeling for what's coming. My name is Matthias, and I want to thank you all for watching. Oh, I got a kill there. Oh, that was too... F oh, he got me with that. Ah, oh, nice shot by him there. Let me play a bit with this a little bit more. And then... I'll do the Farquhar or whatever. Oh my god. Holy moly. The amount of... What? Does it have cool... Does it even have cooldown this weapon? I don't even know. The amount I had to shoot that, that guy before he died though. <laughs> Are you serious? Oh, the hipfire is strong. <laughs> Not so. Ah, trench carbine. What? He's the only one that's killed me, I think. Yeah, he's the only one that's killed me. Ba Black manger. Water cooled barrel. Imagine how heavy that must be to run around with that gun. A water cooled barrel. <laughs> I don't worry. Guys were tough a hundred years ago. The amount that you have to shoot them, though. What, he's level 20? Oh, I'm level 19. Düşman makine bu tüfeği görüldü. We have taken objective Charlie. Is he alone there? Oh, there he came on a flank. That was a good flank. I hit him twice, but said he got. No, oh, now we have less people again. Huh? I need to go to bed soon. The enemy controls all objectives. Thank <laughs> you. 
so many people there. All right.